Eddie Brock, listen to me! Eddie! This... this isn't you! No! Joyce! Eddie! You're not a killer anymore, don't you get it? Let me drain the radiation. I'm not boarding this train, Eddie. Cause you're not the engineer driving it right now. Hang on, Parker. Just hold him up for another few seconds. I'm almost there. Reason. I didn't need a reason, other than to make it easier to kill you. O'Hara, it looks like you called it. Let's finish this now. Parker! Parker, are you there? Peter! Peter! I'm trying to tell myself that I'm just jealous of Walker Sloan's progress. It was only five years ago that he first showed up at Alchemax talking about harnessing energy from the fourth dimension. Now he won't stop until he's running the place. I know his type. He's thinking beyond Alchemax, aiming towards who knows what. He's the exact type of corporate monster I've sworn to rein in. Especially if he's mucking with time travel. The year 2099 might not be much, but it's all mine. And he's not going to change it. He's been siphoning Alchemax resources into converting the gateway and the old virtual unreality lab into something else. Something dangerous. I've tried talking to him, but he's got no time for Miguel O'Hara. But people make time for Spider-Man. Just use the convenient access to the ventilation system to get inside, and then Walker and I can have a little chat. I see they've been keeping busy in the cybernetics division. That's a lot of shocking robots down there. During the day, as Miguel O'Hara, Alchemax geneticist, I could have walked right in. But at night, the security protocols kick in. The genetics lab. Without that department, I wouldn't be the man I am today. Sloan's gotta be around here somewhere. I just know it. You'd think the largest tech developer in the world could afford to carpet their air ducts for extra comfort. There you are. Holographic assistant, online. How may I serve you, Mr. Sloan? Hello, Joseph. Run a final check and initiate security bioscans. Preparing systems, Mr. Sloan. This won't take long. I knew he was up to something. I'm almost embarrassed it took me so long to come up with it. I simply go back in time and launch Alchemax years before it was originally founded. Not only can I remake Alchemax in my image, but you can dismantle Stark Fujikawa before it gets started. You're a genius, sir. I programmed you well, Joseph. No, you don't get away from me that easily. Of course, the CEO will want me to have that degree of power. He's all about power, but he won't have anything to say about it by the time I'm done. This thing.
thing's almost fully charged and I don't have a clue how to shut it down. Any chances to get to the lab before it's too late? Slow! Get back here! the only newspaper man in the city that realizes what a menace that webhead is? Oh, uh, Jonah, um, indoor voice, okay? I'm trying to get Mary Jane on the phone. People lionizing that freak. Next thing you know, there'll be a musical about him with a chorus line of dancing Spider-Man. I'd pay to see that. Oh, Mary Jane, hi. see a show. Uh, MJ, I, I would love to, but I'm working with Dr. Octavius in the genetics lab on a DNA project. I had to download a sample of my own DNA into the permanent Alchemax genetic files. I'm still waiting for some test results. Permanent files, huh? Great, so a hundred years from now we can clone you. <laughs> yeah, I don't think so. Well, how about I come there and we grab a late dinner afterward, okay, Tiger? Yeah, sure, it's okay. Anything for you, babe. And I love when you call me Tiger. It's like a blast from the past. He did it. That lunatic actually did it. I saw it all. Peter. Peter Parker. Who's that? Who's talking? Miguel O'Hara, the Spider-Man from 2099. Are, are the other me's in my head, too? No. It's just me and you, old-timer. I threw together a chronal link program using a sample of your DNA. It's allowing me to communicate with you at the point in time it was taken. I just wish it was from earlier on. We have almost no time. Time until what? Until you're killed. Un until I'm what now? Because it kind of sounded like you said kill. Listen, a lunatic named Walker Sloan from 2099 created a time gateway. It was a one-way trip that dumped him sometime in the 1970s. He then used his advanced knowledge to build Alchemax, years before it was supposed to be established, transforming your world and mine. But I work for Alchemax. You're saying that's somehow wrong? Completely. At this point in time, you earn a living taking news pictures for J. Jonah Jameson. <laughs> the, the late night ranting TV news guy? <laughs> forget it. You can't forget it. Where does this so-called death happen? Sloane's building another gateway on the 66th floor so he can finally travel back and forth. I saw you being killed right there. By who? I couldn't make it out. It doesn't matter. Get out of the building. So a crazed killer can wander around the building without me to stop him? No way. Besides, if I find this guy somewhere else, then I'm invincible. Because I can only die at the gateway, right? It's not an exact science, Parker. Meaning what? You want to spend an hour getting a crash course on temporal physics? No? Then do what I say. <laughs> You've got a lot to learn about priorities, pal. I'm gonna do what I think is right. And that means going after bad guys. You want a Spider-Man who'll do whatever you want? Go play a video. Intruder detected. Employ lethal force. Oh, great. A Centurion. Floor. Where are you? Is this anti venom still hiding? I'm face to face to face with anti venom. Eddie, you're responsible for the explosions? 
trying to blow you up. If you were really trying, you'd have done it. What's going on? Kill you. Now. You've never been anyone's patsy. Oh, good. Stand there and call him names. Great plan. Child is scarce. Eddie, listen. You've got a chip inside you that's making you do this. Just making it easier. The longer that thing's in you, the more it's rewiring your thinking. No. No, it can't. from it, but it's not gonna last forever. Just give me a minute to take care of the other two regulators. A minute's about all I have. Back off, Eddie! You're a puppet! Fight the puppet master, not me! Difficult for me to... You don't know what you're doing! I know enough. You have to die. Or we both can live! You think you're so much better than I am? Acting like... You're so worried about me. I'm worried about what you'll do to other people. And yeah, to me. But if you can fight it... He can't. Trust me. Oh yeah, I always trust people who are trying to kill me. So you're the head lunatic. Well, we haven't been properly introduced. I'm the guy who's gonna stop your plans. Good luck with that. Anti-venom? Finish him. Can't! Can't! Impressive resistance. But activating all the control chips... Releasing your more bestial side should do the trick. So I can go back now and take out Sloan once and for all. Oh, great, no spider sense. No, no. Ah! I'm trying to cure you. Go cure yourself. Ah. Nice try. Didn't work. Yes, it did. Now to finish the job. The chip they stuck in you is messing with your power. Fight it, Eddie. You're about to die. Eddie, don't you get it? This is your chance to take back your mind. You can end this now. Yes, end this. Good. By ending you. O'Hara, you might get to be right after all. Believe me, that's the last thing I want. Almost hitting you. That makes two of us. Spider-Man, but I've had a hundred years to plan this. Keep your friends close and your enemies closer. I kept you close to keep an eye on you, make use of you. But now you're done, and I'm done with you. O'Hara, uh, a little help? O'Hara, if you're there, I've got nothing left. No power. No, no nothing. You tried to warn me. 
I was an idiot. Stop talking about yourself in the past tense. This isn't over. Spoken like someone who isn't here. I will be. Just hold on. I'm doing what I can. Come on, Parker. Where's that never say die attitude? I don't need to say it to do it. And I'm out of jokes. Huh. Come on, Spidey. Hold it together. Just another few seconds. Let's get your strength back. <laughs> Listen to me. I should have found a way to get him to listen. What have you got me into the middle of, Walker? I'm just a scientist for the love Stop of... Stop whining, Octavius. You knew I was out to change the future. I didn't know the future was going to start fighting back. The forces we're unleashing with this quantum tunnel... It's under control. It's out of control. And Spider-Man is still alive to stop it. We'll just send Anti-Venom after him. The Gateway just needs a minute to recharge if it's going to send him through safely. This has to work. It has to. Oh, no. The Gateway's powering up. Oh no, you don't! Pasty-faced pansy! What the hell? The place is crawling with Spider-Man! Don't worry, Anti-Venom will step on this one. I don't understand. Why aren't Anti-Venom's powers draining his- Because mine are radiation-based, if you have to know. Didn't know. Don't care. His regenerator must have brought him to the surface. Oh, yeah. Well, where am I? Parker! You're alive? Miguel, there's some kind of monsters breaking in. Where'd they come from? Just keep calm! They're probably mutation experiments from other generation eggs in that lab! Most likely they'll want to eat you for raw materials! Oh boy. I'm going after Anti-Venom. You try not to get killed. Again. Too much for you! You did it to me. Let me show you just how grateful I am! No! Keep back! What side, you fool? Regeneration complete in three, two, one. Regeneration complete. You are fully healed, Mr. Parker. Room spinning. I can barely stand. Where am I? You're in 2099, Parker. The cellular regenerator healed you. I'm gonna toss a piece of junk to see if the gate's working one way. Incoming! It came through. Perfect. Huh. Plus, I'm feeling like my old self. Strength and everything. Yeah, well, it's a good thing the cellular regenerator had your DNA on record. Good. Stand back. Uh, what do you mean? I'm coming through the gateway. Wait, the return circuits are fried. I won't be able to come through even if you set it up on that end. I'll be stuck here. So fix it. I can't. The technology doesn't exist here yet. You need to find the repair parts on your side, and then send them through. I'll guide you to where they are. 
I'm in the gateway room. All right, throw the parts through, one at a time. Passing them through the energy stream should reverse the energy buildup, but if you toss them in all together, it'll trigger the... Okay, okay, I get it. We got any clue why Otto's tentacles keep coming out of nowhere? He may still be alive, but we mentioned him trying to get out. Or drag us in. I wish I knew how to get rid of these shocking tentacles. Have you got the new parts in place? Yeah, I just have to activate the breakers. Good plan. Without getting killed, a power flow. I need to find the schematics to figure out why. If the archives room here is in the same place it is in my time, it should be accessible through a vertical tunnel. You stay put. Okay, I'm here, so how do I access it? Enter my password, Lila, L-Y-L-A. Access denied. How oh, great. You got any other ideas? L let me think. I wish I could just say open sesame or grant me access or... Request acknowledged. Access granted. That was weird. Okay, let's go over the starter procedures. Slow down, Parker. It's not that simple. Did you fire up the quark enhancers? Activate the tachyon relays? Yes, yes, I did all that. No, you just... Uncouple the Heisenberg compensators. Yes, of course I... Oh, shuck it. No, I didn't. I was right. <laughs> wow. I... Oh, no. What's wrong? It's Mary Jane. She dies. Uh, tonight. Right there at Alchemax! How, how do you know? For shock's sake, Parker, what part of Don't Poke Around in the Archives was unclear? Fine, I'm a nosy Parker, but now that I've found out, it's- It's what? My job to save her? I've got enough to deal with! You can't mean that! You can't just ignore that she's in danger! Hey, I'm trying to focus on what's important! What's important is not standing by and allowing someone to suffer or die because you do nothing! If you don't get that, then you don't get the first thing about being Spider-Man! You're the one who doesn't get it, Parker! The future depends on- My future is meaningless without her! This is gonna be a huge mistake. I owe you, Miguel. Big time. Shock and right you do. But, well, maybe this'll help even the score for everything the world owes you. Thank you. I mean that. Man, I must have been crazy to think about staying here. If people I love are going to be in danger, then I need to be there to help them. Oh, now what? Holy, it, it is her. Then we're out to the gateway room. Tell me when you're there as well. We have to time this right. You got it, Miguel. <laughs> oh, how nice. You and your counterpart are on a first name basis now. It's good to know you've bonded. Who are you? I'm the CEO of Alchemax. The real question is, who are you, old friend? Old friend? So this is where you make the big reveal and I say, holy cow, Norman Osborn, or the Kingpin, Joni Jameson. Come on, please be Jameson. <sighs> All of them long dead, I fear. Too bad they didn't have access to the anti-aging drug we developed. <laughs> it does wonders for you. And I do mean you. No, it, it can't be. It can't be, yes. Why do people always say that? Good thing your future counterpart saved us, eh? Otherwise, we couldn't be this. I, I become the evil mastermind? Oh, don't be melodramatic. With great power comes great responsibility and great opportunity. And the only way to live up to all that responsibility is to use every opportunity to get all the power. I learned that the day I lost everyone I loved and didn't have the power to stop it. What do you mean, everyone? You'll find out. Except once I've fixed reality, you actually won't find out. Consider yourself lucky. Peter, it's up and running, but it's not tremendously stable. Where are you? I think... I think I'm in hell. The CEO. It's me. What? That's... that's insane. How can that be? Holy shock! Peter, now! Move! Move! Let me explain it all to you. Explain it to my rapidly retreating backside! And don't say if! I can still take the CEO! His armor's starting to overheat. He can't control the energy! Just as I figured! It's... it's all back to normal. 
Same here. Okay, but if the timeline snapped back to normal, if none of it happened, how do you and I remember it? I mean, we've got two different sets of memories in our brains. Shouldn't that be making us, I don't know, crazy? <laughs> crazy? We already dress in skin-tight costumes and fight bad guys for free. Okay, crazy-er. You really want a five-hour lecture on temporal paradoxes? Sure, why not? As it turns out, looks like I have all the time in the world.